Future long duration missions uh, are going to be a lot more challenging than living on ISS from a um, mental health uh, perspective. The further you go away from Earth, uh, the less you have an opportunity of uh, um, connection and communication with our, your friends and your loved ones. The delays become uh, significant so that you know, real time communication at some point uh, becomes uh, very difficult. Probably the, the, the physical distance also can, can have an effect in, in making you feel uh, um, you know, far and uh, isolated. At the same time, I think that a long journey on a small vessel, for example, to get to Mars, is going to be potentially challenging us in terms of boredom. They will have to come up with uh, something for uh, crew members to do on the way there. Here on Space Station, we're like super busy all the time, but we have a gigantic space station where there is uh, an enormous amount of uh, activity going on every day. And so if anything, we are like rushing to get everything done that needs to get done. Um, but I can imagine that on a small transit vehicle that is really meant only for that, for transit, um, on a normal day where you know nothing breaks and there is no emergency, yeah, it, it can become just challenging to keep be people mentally active and, uh, and busy. Space is going to be a lot more constrained, so issues of uh, you know living together in a harmonious way uh, are going uh, to be more uh, prominent than they are up here on space station, where we have uh, plenty of space and uh, you know uh, if we need to, we can find privacy and, and space to um, retire and be on uh, on our own.